has the fastest winds in the solar system. But it also has a great dark spot, a mysterious hurricane-like storm that appears and disappears with no warning. It flies around the planet counterclockwise. Discovered by Voyager 2, it's big with black and blue features. It appears to be a fierce storm about the size of Earth. Scientists don't know what causes it to form or why it's black. It's a mystery like another storm in our solar system. Saturn is famous for its magnificent rings, but is a little mysterious when it comes to its atmosphere. But sit back and wait 30 years, and Saturn will put on a storm so magnificent it would impress Mother Nature herself. It's called the Great White Spot, a gigantic storm that develops every 30 years on Saturn's surface eventually covering the entire equator. This is truly a planetary scale phenomenon, and we think it's a monstrous, monstrous thunderstorm. Scientists have observed the storm developing at Saturn's equator, where it receives the most heat from the sun. Perhaps heat builds over time and finally bursts into a storm on a planet that has no surface or friction to slow it down. In other words, it's sort of like a vicious circle where once you get the ball, the ball rolling, it just rolls down the hill and, you know, the storm goes global. Months later, the storm runs out of energy, only to lie dormant for another 30 years. What the cause or timescale means, scientists truly don't know. But Saturn's great white spot is not as powerful or everlasting as our biggest storm in the solar system. Jupiter has long been a source of fascination for scientists when studying wild weather in space. And its great storm has been a feast for the eyes for centuries. Jupiter is the giant of our solar system, dwarfing all other planets. So it's only fitting its weather also becomes a showpiece of sheer force and incredible size. In 1664, the astronomer Robert Hooke noticed something strange about Jupiter. There was a pimple there, which we now call the Great Red Spot. It's been stable. Think of it. A planetary storm, several times the size of the Earth, stable since 1664. This is one of the amazing features of our solar system. The Great Red Spot was named that long before we knew what it was because you can see it from a telescope on Earth. And so for hundreds of years, people have known about this great red spot. The great red spot is the most impressive storm of our solar system. And it's been churning for at least 300 years. The mother of all hurricanes in our solar system is actually on Jupiter. It's not technically a hurricane, but it behaves very much like one. It has a heat source. It has swirling winds, but it dwarfs anything on our planet. This storm is so big, you could take two Earths and stick them right inside the storm. The winds are blowing at 300 miles an hour. Both hurricanes and the Great Red Spot are giant vortices. In the case of hurricanes, they're a low pressure center. The Great Red Spot is a high pressure center. In both cases, there are high speed winds circling the vortex. 
Like a giant eye, the storm continuously circles Jupiter. Wind speeds reach 400 miles per hour, and the giant red spot never seems to dwindle in strength. Powered by the internal heat of Jupiter, it also eats anything in its path. If you're a small vortex and you're in the path of the great red spot, look out, you're gonna be gobbled up like a little fish. Scientists believe the lack of friction or surface on Jupiter might allow this storm to churn uninterrupted for centuries more. On Earth, because of the strong friction, when hurricanes hit land, they tend to fall apart in just a few days. On the other hand, the Great Red Spot has a lifetime of over 100 years. We don't really understand this in detail, but it probably means that the friction in Jupiter's atmosphere is very weak compared to an Earth's atmosphere. Jupiter is a good example of a, of a planet where the planet itself is what's supplying at least some of the energy to drive a storm that's lasting for, for centuries. Weather, the state of an atmosphere. Throughout the universe, familiar weather events on Earth are played out in fantastic ways on other planets.